purchased the Odin 2 with a specific project in mind, crafting my handheld emulator console. It's undeniably the pinnacle of Android handheld devices currently available, albeit at a premium price point. However, the investment is justified by the exceptional quality it delivers. The device feels substantial in hand, with all controls, D-pad, analog sticks, triggers, and buttons exhibiting a reassuring solidity, though the two additional back buttons do emit a faint creaking noise. Performance-wise, it's a powerhouse, effortlessly handling emulators for a vast array of consoles, stretching up to PS2 and Switch. Remarkably, it maintains cool, quiet operation. The fan is scarcely audible, even quieter than my Nintendo Switch. The battery life is exceptional, with hours of play barely making a dent. I've yet to see it drop below 50%. It's important to note that the Odin 2 functions as a basic Android device out of the box, akin to a smartphone or tablet, with no pre-installed games, software, BIOS, or ROMs. While its built-in OS adeptly handles fundamental tasks like controller configuration, external display output, etc., transforming it into an emulator console demands a non-trivial amount of setup and configuration. Nevertheless, the effort pays off handsomely. A handheld capable of smoothly running retro games with features like upscaling, post-processing shader effects, safe states, cheats, and fast-forwarding, capabilities far beyond those of the originals. Plus, the versatility extends to installing regular Android games from the Google Play Store.